Liza's Kitchen presents Cooking with Chef Mike with Cat on Wine. This month, Chef Mike took us through four courses with Oktoberfest as the main theme. Today, we'll be taking a look at the second course, Spetzel. Start off with some boiling water and add some salt to it. And you can mix your flour, nutmeg, salt, and pepper in a mixing bowl. And then start to add the wet ingredients, the two eggs. Add a quarter cup of milk. And then begin mixing. The mix should look uh, pretty thick. It's going to look pretty doughy. And uh, once you've got it good and mixed up, pour it into the spetzel maker and into the water through the press there. When the noodles look cooked, they should float, but let them cook for a few more minutes to make sure they're cooked thoroughly. Then stir the spetzel up a bit and place some butter into a pan on medium-high heat. You can add some onions to that pan and then add the spetzel. Be sure to drain the spetzel before you put it into the pan. Add a bit of pepper and then a bit of thyme and chiffonade parsley. Add butter to your heart's content and it should be ready to serve. Let's go over to Kat for the wine pairing. The wine that we're having with this is um, the uh, Spar Riesling. It's a Mosul, um, Germany um, wine, where it's from. The Riesling varietal does really, really well in cold climates. In fact, um, Riesling, Gewürztraminer, um, pretty much all you get out of Germany. Not all you get, but that's what they do their very, very best. And um, and really white wines in general, there are very few red wines that come from um, Germany because of that cold climate. These just do really, really well there. So um, the reason I chose it to go with the Spätzl, 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 um, is uh, for the acidity um, in the finish. It's uh, really got a, a, a kind of a racy minerality and, and really sharp finish that um, I think goes really nicely with the herb, uh, with the butter in particular and the um, kind of creaminess that it creates with the, um, with the noodles. The beer is Shiner Oktoberfest. So it's a Marzen style Oktoberfest. And um, this one is from Texas. So it's German style, but, but local, quasi local. The German, yes. And their, uh, their brewery is called Spotzel. So I thought Spotzel, Spatzel, they, they were meant to go together. So. That's it for this episode of Cooking with Chef Mike. Tune in next time for the third course in Oktoberfest, Wiener Schnitzel and Warm Potato Salad. To learn more about cooking classes at Liza's Kitchen, check lovelizas.com for updates.